Alright, so this was a request from my friend Christina, and this was highly requested actually. Um, I wanted to film this video with a different outfit, um, but you are going to be seeing several videos today with the same blue throw, throw on, uh, which is this. Um, I'm actually on my way to school. I'm very, 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 very super, super late, but I wanted to make some videos before I left the house because I know this weekend is going to be completely busy for me and filming is going to be horrendous. So um, I did want to talk about obtaining a beach body. In short, this is like video part one um, for my large plans for the summer because I will be doing a series of um, not bikini body, but maybe just my summer body in general. Um, maybe not wearing a bikini so much, but putting out there the exercise regimen and whatnot. And um, I will be, for the first time, showing my full entire body on camera. So I thought it was worthy of an announcement. Um, no, I'm just joking. But um, I, I wanted to talk quickly about the first time I felt I had a beach bikini body and this is after being 200 pounds this is after losing the weight this was about 2005 going into 2006 like early 06 and at the time I had um, I had been traveling back and forth to visit my boyfriend who lived in Houston Texas so um, I definitely wanted to be able to wear a bathing suit and not feel uncomfortable um, at the time I was still in my eyes, um, not overweight, but I still had a lot of tightening and toning, and I was probably about 140 or 130 uh, during 2006, and it didn't help because whenever I'd go visit Texas, they always had um, amazing food, and I didn't feel comfortable depriving myself, so um, during that time, sure, I was definitely, you know, concerned um, how I would look especially in a bathing suit, and not only that, but tank tops as well, because if you have a loose tummy, you can't readily, you know, support your um, your your tanks and your tube tops, and um, you definitely need, like, a flat stomach without saying. So um, I then, at the time, was introduced to P90X. P90X was, like, here nor there. It was something that I tried doing, I gave up, I tried again, I gave up again. So it was something that I definitely wanted to devote all my time to and not like half-ass, um, especially since it is such a hardcore workout in and of itself. So um, long story short, uh, what I did was start going on two runs a day. I picked up my cardio. Cardio drops a week off your workouts. Um, if you guys are not runners um, like me, definitely start building up becoming an avid runner. Once you hit like your runner's high, you definitely will start to go out more and you'll get um, uh, more inspiration to run. Um, and I guarantee that because I couldn't even run the track at my school. Um, and that's so pitiful because now I feel like I can finish that like under nine minutes. So um, I definitely think that for those of you that are not runners, again, I repeat, um, start to, you know, start fast paced walking, make make efforts to pick it up and and definitely start to explore becoming a runner. If you guys all already do run, for those of you who are runners, um, you know what I'm talking about. That runner's high is amazing and um, it, it only makes you feel 10 times better about your workout. So um, after I started doing two workouts a day, I really started seeing a difference, not only in my waist, um, in my bust, I started getting muscle striations um, on the side, which I really, really liked because um, I was starting to see muscle striation in places I didn't even know, and my arms were so, so toned. There is a video on here um, coming up, actually, speaking of my two-year anniversary here on YouTube. There is a video that I posted called, like, Playboy Bunny Costume. Uh, it was a crazy video. Anyway, that video, if you guys can find it in the video bar, um, it's an old one from, like, April 2010 that's still on here. Um, that video itself, I was, I will admit I was too skinny. I was, like, 109 pounds in that video. But if you look at my arms, I mean, for a small, petite girl, I was toned and chiseled. So if you guys find that video, watch it, because I was definitely doing P90X at that time, and I was running twice a day. So I was a maniac, and um, I really needed to be stopped. But anyway, um, that's how I got to my beach body, a lot of cardio, and I know a lot of you guys who are trainers or watch my um, channel and give me advice to spread out to um, all my subbies. Um, I definitely did tone up, 
Um, I went to the gym as well and I was doing weights. Um, even though I was really, really petite, I still knew how to train. And I had a friend that was training me at the time too. So a lot of those things kind of come into play. And um, that is kind of like my formula for a beach body. If you guys don't want to be like super muscular, that was my thing. I definitely did stick to the twice a day cardio and ate very, very well. I don't think there was a day where I ever had fast food, um, not even a drink like soda or a McFlurry. So my phone's ringing. I have to go, but keep that in mind. And this is the fitness video for today.